This was a plot. This was a plan. This was a scheme. This was not a riot or a crowd that got over enthusiastic and, and sort of spun out of control. And I can't wait to see more information in the coming public hearings about the meeting in the Oval Office between Trump, Flynn, Giuliani and Powell. I'm quite sure the J6 committee has some information about that they're going to present, because last night we sort of got the impression that there were no adults in the room at the time, right? No lovers of democracy in there to, to try to keep that, that conspiracy, you know, contained. And we heard that, you know, some people did rush in when they heard these, these folks were meeting in the Oval Office. Correct. But about an hour after that meeting, we got the tweet. The plan had been hatched. And Donald Trump was implementing it. Come to D.C. on January 6th. We'll be wild. Enjoy the other word that you've already picked up on and others have picked up on that we heard yesterday was war. Why does that become important? Well, where is that word prominently featured in the big, ugly blue book of federal laws, the United States Code? The crime of treason. And every time I heard war, my mind went back to treason, which is a very short and simple statute. Whoever, owing allegiance to the United States, like the president, levies war against the United States, is guilty of treason. What we now know is Donald Trump not only set the date for the Capitol attack, as we've just discussed, but he also refused to call off his Correct. angry mob once he deployed them for more than three hours. Mm -hmm. But I think what we learned a little bit more about last night was not only did he refuse to call off the attack, he refused to authorize the deployment of any forces to go to the Capitol to fend off the attack, to protect the people in the U.S. Capitol that he set his angry mob on. And it took an order from Mike Pence, who right. frankly probably didn't have the authority at that moment. But General yeah. Milley said he was insistent. We have to get forces to the Capitol. To, and Mike Pence is no hero. He was protecting his own skin because he was in the Capitol. Yeah. But you know what? This begins to feel not just like treason, but like treason squared. 